Hi, it's me, Granny. Once upon a time, nestled in a quaint little town, lived the loving family of Mr. Samson and Serena. Their home was filled with warmth and laughter, especially with their two energetic boys, Richie and Richard. Richie, the elder one, was a curious nine years old, always eager to explore. While Richard, at six, was a bundle of joy, spreading smiles wherever he went. The family was overjoyed when they received the delightful news that Serena was expecting a new addition to their family. Richie and Richard couldn't contain their excitement at the thought of having a little sister to play with. They spent hours imagining all the adventures they would have with their new sibling. As the days passed, Serena's pregnancy journey continued. Filled with anticipation and love. And finally, the long awaited day arrived. Little fairy, as Richard Loving named her, made her grand entrance into the world, bringing immense joy and happiness to the entire family. She's finally here, our little fairy. Isn't she just perfect? Wow, she's so tiny. Can I hold her mom? Richie said. I want to give her a hug. She's so cute, mom. Welcome to the world. You are going to bring so much joy to our lives. I can't believe she is finally in my arms. Our family feels complete now. Mom, can I help take care of her? I want to be the best big brother ever. I'll help too. I can sing her a lullaby to help her sleep. Thank you, boys. You are going to be amazing big brothers to fairy. Let's make a promise to always look out for each other and make sure Fairy grows up surrounded by love. I couldn't ask for a better family. Together we can conquer anything that comes our way. I love you guys and I love our little Fairy. I love you too, Richie. And I love our new baby sister. From the moment Fairy entered their lives, she brought a sense of magic and wonder. Her infectious giggles and sparkling eyes lit up the house, making every day brighter than the last. Richie and Richard dotted on their baby sister showering her with love and affection. But amidst the joy of Fairy's arrival, the family faced a new challenge. Taking care of a newborn required dedication and teamwork. Serena, being a devoted mother, tirelessly tended to Fairy's need. But the nights of sleepless cries took a toll on her. Realizing the importance of supporting Serena and helping care for Fairy, Mr. Sampson, Richie and Richard came together as a team. Boys, your mom needs some help around the house, especially now with Fairy keeping her busy. 
What can we do, Dad? I am ready to help out however I can. Me too, Dad. I want to be a big helper like Richie. Great attitude, boys. Richie, how about you help your mom with cleaning the living room? Sure thing, Dad. I'll make sure it sparkles like new. And Richard, how about you assist your mom in the kitchen? Maybe help her with setting the table. Okay, Dad. I'll make sure everything is perfect for dinner. And while you are both helping out, I'll take care of washing the dishes after we eat. Thanks, Dad. Teamwork makes the dream work, right? Yeah. We are going to make mom's life so much easier. That's the spirit, boys. Let's show your mom how much we appreciate everything she does for us. Mom, we are here to help. What can I do first? Oh, Richie, you are such a sweetheart. How about you start by dusting the shelves? And I'll help you set the table, Mom. Thank you, boys. Having you both by my side makes everything so much easier. We are team Serena. We'll get through this together. They devised a plan to share the responsibilities and ease Serena's burden. Each family member took on specific tasks to ensure Fairy received the love and attention she deserved. Mr. Sampson took charge of washing the pots after meals, relieving Serena of one of her daily chores. Richie eagerly pitched in by assisting his mom with household cleaning, ensuring their home remained neat and tidy. Richard, with his adorable innocence, would keep Fairy entertained with his playful antics whenever Serena needed a break. The family's bond grew stronger as they worked together to care for Fairy. They embraced the challenges with open hearts knowing that their love and support would guide them through any obstacle. With each passing day, Fairy flourished under the care of her devoted family, filling their home with even more love and laughter. In the end, it's not the challenges they faced or the chores they conquered that define their story, but the unwavering love and support they have for each other. Dear viewers, if you like my stories, stay connected with me by like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.